So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to search and type in VPN settings. Click on it. Make sure that you have no VPN enabled right now. If you see anything here, you just wanna disable it. Now for the second step, you're gonna head over to search again and type in proxy settings. Click on it. Same thing for the proxy server as well. If you have any proxy set up right now, you wanna disable it. So you're gonna click on setup. Make sure you have this turned off. And I click on setup right here as well. Make sure that you also have this turned off as well. And I click on save. And now for the next step, you're gonna head over to search and type in view network connections. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you wanna find your network adapter. You're gonna double click on it. And then click on properties. And then click on internet protocol version four. Make sure that you have obtainer IP just automatically selected and obtain DNS server just automatically also selected. So you wanna have these both on the default option and then click on okay. And now for the next step, you wanna head over to search and type in CMD. Now you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you wanna type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS, click on enter. And now we're gonna type in netsh space winsock space reset, click on enter again. And now for the last step, you just wanna restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.